Hello and welcome back to Silver Run Forest in Farming Simulator 22. And as you can see, the roller coaster is finished. <laughs> we finished it last time, uh, if you missed the episode. Uh, to my surprise, we finished it. And uh, the other thing we finished was Field 36. This field here in front of us, and uh, if I can just fly for a second, you can see the field we've made, which used to look like this. Full of trees and rocks and deer. But now we've done a lot of work on it and the target to turn it into a field is complete. And this is corn in the field. And as you can see, it's at its first growth. Let's make sure the train's not coming. And just have a look because we now need to fertilize this and do the weeding as well. Uh, but this has posed me with a bit of a problem because the target of the roller coaster is finished. We've completed the roller coaster and the target of turning field 36 into a field is finished. And I like working to target, so I feel like I'm at a bit of a loose end now. So the target, I mean, we're ending the series on episode 30. Let's just get off the field because I don't like walking on the corn. The new target for the end of the series, we're on episode 26 now, I think, and the, the last episode will be episode 30, will be to finish with 1.5 million dollars and as you can see there we've got about half a million but the fly in the ointment is I just discovered that we have a 125,000 uh, pound dollar loan so I'm going to repay this and we also have rented um, our medium tractor here this forestry machine here is going back at the end I, I don't want to keep this I'm not going to pay for it but the Deutzvar tractor, which we want to keep, will cost us 219000 We also have a trailer. These two things here on... I didn't real. I thought we'd bought these things, but obviously we haven't. So we need to pay for those as well. So I have a little mission now before the end of the series to end on 1.5 million. If we look at our, our stock index here, we can see a few things that will help us. Like bathtubs, <laughs> funnily enough, buckets... We had shingles last time. There were absolutely loads of shingles. What about those? They're green. We should sell those today. And prefab walls. There's loads of stuff we could sell. Look at those planks, planks long. And also the metal. Where's the metal? Just here. So, but the first thing, first things first, we need to um, fertilize three fields. Now, I'm going to rent a, a small tractor, which is going to be this one. A lovely old New Holland tractor. Now let's um, see if we can make it. Yeah, 100 horsepower. That should be okay. Uh, front weight. I don't think we need the front weight. Let's just hire it like this. And I'm going to use this with our, what I now discovered to be, our hired John Deere sprayer, which is back at the farm. So I'll go and fetch all the equipment. I'll see you back here. Okay, I changed my mind and I came down to this field number two you can see here because um, if you remember last time we tried to do cosplay on the on the new field on field 36 but uh, we had problems because of the fences and it didn't quite work and I had to just put it on a work in, in the end and turn off cosplay but this field I hope we can use cosplay on to do the uh, the fertilizing so let's just get lined up properly okay that should be okay. I just want to have a look at the cows actually because we've got these cows a little while back and how many have we got? 30, 100%, milk 3,586. Fantastic. Look at the cows. <laughs> so, um, and yeah, we need to keep an eye on the hay that they've got. So I just forget about them because they're down here, you know. So anyway, let's try and sort out cause play for this malarkey. Okay, I think that it's working. Let's just get in into it. Yeah, I think it's working. All right, let's go to our truck. Where's our truck? We have too many things. It's a Volvo, this one here. <laughs> okay, and uh, I think that I will try and sell a few things now because I'd like to get to that target of um, one and a half million. And luckily we have our low loader right next to our metal factory our, our what's it's called now the iron factory whatever it's called so we can 
let's just get connected like that and if I go to productions and the metal factory if I put it on storing they're all there so right let's get them all auto loaded Right, I think that's it. So if we go back to productions, I'll, I'll switch it back on to um, distributing now. That's fine. And where do we sell this stuff? Elm Creek. Okay. All right, let's get going to the train, which is just behind me here. I wonder if I can just drive in here. It looks like it. I think, I think this has been updated. I don't think you could use to drive in here. Uh, I'm kind of on the wrong side. I'll sort this out and uh, I'll see you when I'm kind of more organised. <laughs> okay, so the train is here. Let's jump on board and see if we can auto-load all that stuff. And the answer is yes. I mean, I should get some more stuff to... Um, before I before I send the train on its way, but uh, well, I'll just keep going now, and and we'll see what we get. Here we are at Elm Creek. Wow, one hundred and twelve thousand plus seven thousand. Okay, so we got we're back up to nearly. Half a million again, that's fine. Let's see how the guy's doing here. Wow, okay. Uh, let's just have a look on uh, this, saving content. So, okay, he's done pretty well because that was a tricky headland to do actually. So, this is fantastic. I think what I'll do is go and get some more stuff. Let's have a look on the uh, stock index to see what else is hot today. Yeah, definitely the shingles and also the prefab walls. So what I'm going to do first is go to the shingles and pick them up and then drive up to the sawmill. So I'll see you at the shingle shop. Wow, look at all these shingles, man. <laughs> Yeah, I, I knew they were here because I saw, have to sort, come down here and sort them out last time. But uh, they spawned quite a few more. I'm not sure I can get all the um, the prefab walls on. But I probably don't need to because I can, I can just carry those across. Let's get all these loaded anyway. Alright, I think that's it. I'm going to get up to the sawmill. I'll see you there. Okay, nearly everything loaded. I just need to get a few more prefab walls loaded. Oh, don't tell me I can't load those ones. Let's just have a look. Okay, I'll just stick it on the top. I hope that's okay. <laughs> Alright, let's strap it all down, if I can. All strapped. Right, let's go backwards to Elm Creek. Okay, just make sure it doesn't fall off like it used to. Pretty good. 151,000 plus 10,000 environmental score reward. Okay, I don't think things are falling off now. I think that's fixed. Right, um, I need to get the the truck out of here and then let's go and see how the, uh, the fertilising is going. Okay. Very good. So if we look at the field, we can see it down in the bottom left there, but he's obviously finished the field. So let's go over to the field over here because we need to do this one as well. Right, so I'm going to try putting this one on course play, but the problem I always get is when I want to do... Where is he? Just here. When I want to do a second field... Um, 
Is it set destination? The target is here. Yeah, it's it's set up on this one, so I always have to kind of quit out and come back in again to clear it. Uh, but I'm not sure how to clear it so I can get onto this field. So I'll create job, CP field work, um, open a closed course generator, number of headlands, let's say two this time, generate. And it's still on this field. Okay, I'm not sure what to do, but I'm going to have to quit out and come back in to, to clear the field. Okay, it's the principle of turning it off and turning it back on again. So let's do the same thing. Clear clear these things and then go to uh, the guy who's down here and create job, CP field work. Yeah, it's cleared it now. So, uh, right, let's do, I think, just one headland here and do sharp corners, generate, do that and then do that and then it should start. So... Right, I'm not going to go away. I'm going to I'm going to film this and uh, do a little kind of um, uh, time lapse of it. So I'll see you when it's done. So, I hope it was a good, um, what I call, smell the machinery time lapse because you're much closer up to the machines and um, it's all at real time, you know. So, um, I think what I'll do is, while he remembers his course, um, he's finished work now, while he remembers his course, I'm going to put um, herbicide in the tank and get that done on this field so I don't have to do the shenanigans of switching it off and switching it back on again. So I'll see you back here in a minute when I've got some herbicide in the tank. I used to be so scared of course play. It was so complicated in the old days, but it's got much easier, well for me anyway. Uh, let's get this sort of uh, lined up as best I can on the field here. And then we'll try again, but this time it's herbicide, not fertiliser. That should be okay. Alright then. Uh, right, let's go to... I've had to switch my computer off and on again um, because there was some lag, so I, I, I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Okay, I think it's working. Let's just make sure there's stuff coming out. I think there is. Well, if there are weeds, there are anyway. All right, let's... Um, I'm not going to film that. I'm going to... What I need to do, actually, I have a note to do some forestry. Uh, because the Langholz production doesn't have much wood in it and we, we need that for long planks for all our productions. So I need to do that. And the dual purpose of doing that is that the new field, field uh, 36, um, there's a space there I need to clear for doing corn silage with the new Gervile machines. And there's some trees in the way. So fully grown trees and they'll I'll get a lot of wood out of those. So I will see you at field 36 with the, with the timber runner. I think we all need targets, don't we, to, to work or to do whatever we want to do. Like incentives, like I had the incentive all this time of getting the roller coaster done and getting this field done as well, and now they're both done. Uh, I'm glad to have the incentive of getting lots of cash, you know, before we leave Silver and Forest forever. Well, I'm still going to play this map, actually, even, even when I finish. I'm not going to record it, but I'll just play it on my own. Because I'm really, you know, there's a bit of magic in this map. I wish there were more fields. That's the only thing. So, right. Uh, I'm going to do a bit of sort of super strength forestry here. Most of these trees, I think, are fully grown. And, 
All right, yeah, I'll, I'll see you when I'm done. Okay, I think that's all I can do. Um, that took a long time to do, actually. Um, I've had a few problems today, what with course play, not, well, you know, getting the transfer from one field to the other and driving onto this big lump of rock here. Everything's been a bit of a struggle. So I think uh, I'll make this the last thing to do today. I was gonna sell a few more bits and bobs, but we can do that next time. And I'm even going to do some stuff like off screen so we can get um, to the target of one and a half million because um, I need to get some sort of metal from the uh, the iron ore thing, whatever it's called. I can never remember the name of these things, but you know, the the the, the mine, basically. Um, we need to get some more metal uh, from there. And uh, that's not a very interesting thing to do in the episode. So I'm going to leave that. But anyway, I'll see you when we get to Langholz production. If you remember, Langholz production is the sawmill we put down that makes uh, long planks really quickly. We had a problem with long planks before that uh, there were so many things calling for them and they weren't being produced quickly enough. So Langholz is and was the answer, but uh, just a bit of a thing getting it all in here. <laughs> I just drive into this bit and then strap it and let's see how many attempts it takes us to get all the wood put in. Two, <laughs> basically. So, 41,000 litres of wood in the, in the Lankholz production. Ah, phew. Um, yeah, so I'm going to leave the episode here. I'm sorry if it's short. I'm not sure if it's going to be short or long. I feel like I've been recording for hours. I normally record for about one and a half hours. But I've been recording, I don't know, probably about two hours now because... Uh, oh, finished work. Oh, let's go and see, actually. Finished work. So these two fields, this field here and the field over there. Uh, this is... Uh, what is this in here? Is this sunflowers? Corn. This is corn. And that one over there is sunflowers. Are both completely finished now, which is fa fantastic. Um, so all our fields are finished apart from... I'll show you. Field... 36 which is this one here uh, it doesn't have the number on but it's this field here we need to fertilize it and lime it so uh, not lime it um, herbicide it anyway phew I'll see you next time and uh, when hopefully we can get up to like I say one and a half million million dollars bye for now